What is happening? Oh my god. He seems angry. Just go vegan. He just wants you to go vegan. Do it. So I've been in a whirlpool of what the hell am I doing this past week. I tell you, I thought I had it all figured out. It was perfect. I take these digestive enzymes and then I can eat whatever I want. And apparently that's not how they work. My skin was flawless. I've had it twice now since I've been back to Toronto for like three weeks straight each time. Skin's not breaking out at all. And I'm like, we finally figured it out. We got our balanced diet. We can eat what we want here within a, a realm of meat and bacon and sometimes a liquid plant that's liquefied zero fiber. But for the past like week, I've just been erupting again. I'm like, no, no. It's so annoying. I want to make videos about how to get healthy and I'm erupting just mutants out of my face. And I'm just like lose motivation instantly. I'm like, Follow the carnivore diet. I would debate people, but I show up, I'm like, uh, don't look at me though. Just don't look at me. I have good points, trust me. <laughs> so I think I found the culprit again. So we'll talk about it and explore the villages of these hippie stores. It's a vegan store. That's what vegans wear. Oh my God. So basically, <laughs> my skin was flawless until I came here. Do you remember the video? I forget what it was about, but it was here. And I bought a bunch of stuff. I reviewed that carnivore bar. That thing was delicious. miss it <laughs> so my skin was flawless until like a few days after that something I bought cuz I bought a bunch of things those gut shots I forgot to get that again god damn it god damn it so it was something I was eating that day something I bought that day and started eating I've narrowed it down I think I'm 91% sure it's the honey it was the honey. And this seems to be the way. On carnivore diet, I can handle certain carbs, but not others. So my donkey ass was fine with white rice. What the hell, I went to a Korean barbecue. I was eating all kinds of stupid shit. Kimchi, spicy things, noodles. Frickin' buckwheat noodle, or the yam noodle. I don't know what it was. Didn't even matter that night. <laughs> so I was fine, no breakouts. I even had ice cream at Baskin Frickin' Robbins. Vegan ice cream, of course. So vegan right now. So that led me to believe that I could eat as much ice cream as I wanted, as long as it was vegan fruit-based ice cream. So I bought that mango ice cream, I was eating it, I seemed to be fine. But when I started digging into that honey, honey, no thank you. I don't know why. Why? Is it the sugar? Is it the fructose to glucose ratio? Is it some undiscovered compound? Like, honey is full of a thousand things that nobody's ever even discovered yet. So it's like, could be the enzyme, B enzymes. Disturb my liver, and then we're done. But I don't think it's as simple as just carbs give you acne, or me at least. It's like, not all carbs, just some carbs. Maybe it's just because it's so concentrated. Just a big spoonful of sugar, but when I started increasing it, that's when it, I erupted even more and more. So I eliminated the ice cream a while ago, still kept breaking out. Kombucha was still going, I kicked that out, still breaking out. It's like, now I feel like we're calming down because the honey is out of my life. We made it, healthy butcher. Let's do this right now. So I got pork meat one. It's a good source of pork flavonoids and pork polyphenol seven good for you. You just lick the tongue once. So my plan is to go on a bit of a pork cleanse for a little bit and then stop experimenting. 
Stop trying to find new foods that can possibly give me acne. That's what I keep doing. What else can I add? Just stop adding things. Just be nice and calm with your stupid diet. So now the big test comes. I have no source of carbs now. Usually I feel a little better with some carbs. That's why I'm adding them in. So will I finally kick into keto? Most carnivores I know cheat sometimes on white rice. Some They're not carnivores. We're not really carnivores. We were never carnivores. Just in it for the beef benefits. Let me know down below if you're on this style diet, like meat heavy, zero carbs, and you feel fantastic. You can work out, go about your daily life, no problems. I need to know that. I need to know it's possible for me. continue on the carnivore trap it really is a trap there ain't nowhere to go once you get into the carnivore diet it's like what else what the hell they whip you it's like a cult and you leave you hop over the fence of the carnivore club and they whip you snakes there's a reason nobody leaves the carnivore club it's because they can't they can't digest a damn thing i want to be the first one to leave it just boom breaks out films it crosses the field into a nut patch Almond tree, make Lou Corona nut yogurts, and live to tell the tale. Man, that is an old tin of cookies. That's really old. There's stuff in there. And wood, free wood, if you want some. So I'll stick to my meaty ways for now, but if things don't drastically improve, within a couple months of being more strict, then it's just like another dead end road like veganism was. Well, then where the hell do I go? If I'm not entirely meat based or vegan, there's nothing in between. Balances for ballerinas. What's the perfect diet? Is it ostrich meat? <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. Why'd I stop? He's a stronger carnivore than me. Oh, he peed to Marcus territory. He proved it. He proved it right there. Oh god, that's embarrassing. That is embarrassing. I got the pepperonis. It's a good source of pepperoni one. I tell ya. I tried to get that on the vegan diet once. It's no picnic, that one. That's no picnic. So I think we're done. I've imparted a lot of wisdom today. Just use it carefully. Be responsible with it. Don't get too healthy too fast or you'll fall off your unicycle of love. You don't want that? Yes, I wear socks and sandals. I'm bringing it back. It never left, in my opinion. People keep commenting about it. I find it so funny. People are so brainwashed. Like one guy wore Birkenstock sandals and knee-high socks once, and someone took a picture of them, and they're like, oh my god, socks and sandals, what do you do? <laughs> it's phenomenal. This is the best footwear possible. Y'all don't know what you're doing. So, we're done. We're done here for today. Thank you so much for watching the video. That was a car alarm. His car will be safe tonight. Thumbs up if you liked the video. Thumbs down if you drink vinegar instead of water just to wake you up. Why do you do it? Just be normal like me eating nothing but meat and kombucha maybe cucumber juice take that life hack I didn't get hit by a car we're done thank you so much for watching video subscribe for more videos vegetable please turn I hear Reggie are you coming to greet me buddy hey buddy hey Reg cat Mm-hmm. <laughs>